गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स सी काले अपने रेकॉर्डिंग नतु थे शेखु ऐतला मटे अपने काले कोई पक्का ना वीडियो ना तो अजे अपने आगर बढ़िये शे रिस्पांस अगर ता ए बाइट इफेक्टस ये मां अपने जनरली स्वाइट में लेते तो ये रेगुलर कॉन्फर्म्स माइक्रेट एंड सस्पेंडेड बराबर चे अने एक क्वेरीज जो थी तमारे लोगों मा के एक पर्टिकुलर लाइन चे ये तमे समझावन भी तो तो के सर जे लाइट चे एनी अंदर के पर्टिकुलरली तो सम ऑफ द ऑर्गेनिज्म्स पर्टिकुलरली आर रिस्पॉन्ड अगेंस्ट द इंटेंसिटी ऑफ द लाइट एंड फोटो पीरियड्स एंड फॉरेजिंग माइग्रेटरी एक्टिविटी इट्स इन्फ्लुएंस ऑन इट बराबर चे तो एनी अंदर सोच है के सपोज जे प्रकार नी लाइट नी इंटेंसिटी वन ये लाइट इंटेंसिटी प्रमाण है दरो के जो जुदा जब एनिमल्स चे चारों कार्बन मटे चारों बाबा टेंट जाता हुआ चे केटलो ये लाइट सावेलेबल था चे प्रमाण है इट्स डिपेंड्स अपॉन पची विंड आर ने समान नहीं माय नहीं और ऐसा ऐसा की बदलाई चलती हुआ चे इवन रिप्रोडक्शन अमुक as well as migration, migration में वो चलेगा। Light intensity higher होगा तो temperature always higher होगा। तो ये प्रमाण है इन्हीं आपकी explanation आती है, okay? Now, as far as the आपने homeostasis किया lecture में ली तो now regulate, confirm us, migrators and suspects. There is four points that we have to go to explain. Now regulate is concerned. See, most of the organisms can be maintain their internal environment. In spite of that, there is a changes into the external environments. These are the regulators. You see, we can say homeothermic or we can say urethermal. Like birds and mammals, they are homeothermic or urethermal as far as temperature is concerned. Or even as far as osmotic concentration is concerned, even they can maintain their osmotic concentration of internal environment. That is urethermal. So both of these birds and mammals generally they are urethermal as well as we can say urethermal or they are the regulators okay suppose apni j baat kare to apne ko temperature ma jaiye to apne so that we are sweating par se wo bolna pade che generally we can do go go walk at 37 degree temperature okay and if it is more than that then there is a sweating and if there is a cold climate is concerned in that case what happens the shivering is there apne andro jaiye ठंडी लगता है तो वार्म करो। That is one kind of exercise। आपने जब आ रहे तो वार्म करें तो वार्म अप करिए जो। वार्म अप करो। That is one kind of exercise। And that is why we can generate the heat in our body and ultimately we can maintain our body temperature within the body। So that is the regulation that carried out by birds and mammals। Okay? Now confirmers। See, as far as confirmers is concerned, 99% of animals and nearly Almost all the plants, they are conformers as far as temperature is concerned, or as far as the osmotic regulation is concerned. Okay, generally, if the narrow range they can able to maintain that in a narrow range they can able to maintain the temperature as well as we can say osmotic regulation is concerned. Otherwise, along with the external environment, they will change their Osmolarity as well as temperature of the body, they are the confirmers. As far as confirmers is concerned, particularly, you see, generally what happens, apne mode bage air conditions se hum ke on kari deye chhe. Otherwise, everybody can not be at home, be at peace. To pachi so kare, to ke kya hai wale? Parse wale wale hi hai. Apni pay air condition nahi to so kare. Aro bache. To evo it is not like that. Even they can. Without even air condition, they can survive. And second thing, particularly, some of the organisms like uh, shrew, shrew means chachunda, as well as hummingbird, colorful birds are there. Their actually size is very much small. So as compared to their, we can say size or the volume, their surface area is large. You know that surface area in a volume in a साइज करता बढ़ा रहे थे। इन डेट केस पर जब पर दे हो तू प्रोड्यूस द मोर एनर्जी इनटू द क्लोर कॉल क्लाइमेट। सपोज कॉल क्लाइमेट चाहे 
तो शो थे तो यह बॉडी टेम्परेचर मेन्टेन करने लैने शू कर पड़े तो इंटरनल ऑक्सीडेशन मेटाबोलिजम से हायर करव पड़े ने मेटाबोलिजम हायर थाय तो अंदर थी एम कह हीट जनरेट है तब रेस्पिरेशन में जुड़ू तो कि ऑलमोस्ट एटीपी से फोर्ट फिफ्टी फाइव पर्संट तो हीट ज प्रोड्यूस थी जाए तो ये हेपन एंड देट इज वाई वॉट हेपन स्मोलर साइज ऑर्गेनिजम्स ना साइज ऑर्गेनिजम्स है विच इज नॉट अवेलेबल इन टू द पोलर रिजन ऑफ द कोलर क्लाइमेट्स क्या तो ना साइज हे तो शू तो सरफेस एरिया है ये हे स्ट्रक्चर करता है साइज करता मेटाबोलिजम हायर कर साइज ना तो कई बुध फूड नहीं ली सके फूड नहीं ली सके तो कई बड़ी एनर्जी जनरेट नहीं कर सके हिट एनर्जी सर देट इज वाई दे केन नॉट एबल टू सर्वाइव इन कोल्ड एर क्लाइमेट समझे गए ए आ रीते आपने कन्फर्मस है यदर जवाब मे देन मैग्रेटर्स सी सपोज सम ऑफ देम आर नॉट रेग्युलेटर कन्फर्म इन देट केस वॉट एपन Uh, in a stressful conditions, they will migrate into the suitable conditions. Suppose they are in suitable condition or unfavorable condition, or they are so called a suitable or favorable conditions for migrate. Karige. And again, they will come back to their original uh, site when the favorable conditions will be retained in their particular habitat. Now, me, after suppose I did Junagadh, the Simla, Kulu, Manali, J, it's one kind of migration for a temporary period, not for a uh, complete uh, lifetime, right? Even uh, the another example for the migration is concerned. तमे अपने तो जुना के मामले में ना सिमेटा सरोवर है जो मामला चाहिए ना इसी वाय नल सरोवर जैसे वाय चाहिए के पच्ची इवन टैक्स मुक्त वाय कुछ है राजस्थान में परतपुर चाहे ये मां कोई लादे उगाना या करनी मिस वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरीज कोई लादे उगाना वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरीज राइट So flamingo and all, all kind of uh, organisms they are visited in a particular winter seasons, right? That you know that. Then suspended. You see, some of them are cannot migrate into the stressful conditions. In that case, what happened? They have to, we can say, uh, suspended their activity, physiological or metabolic activity. That is what is suspended. Okay. Uh, now in that case, what happened? I may show you again some of the spores. Of Lower kind of or plants is concerned, right? The thick walls spores is formed by in the unsuitable condition or unfavorable conditions, right? In that case, they can survive and able to maintain their existence into that particular, right? That is one of the suspended nature. Second thing I can tell you, as far as hibernation is concerned, in the winter, in the cold climate, bears occur. Bears are swath bears. They are generally undergoes. Hibernation. As far as estivation is concerned, in the summer, snail as well as some fishes will be undergoes estivation. Am jo to crop che ma hibernation estivation be ya kaise? Par apna ye text book ma hibernation and estivation nu je kya hai ke example che ki thoda pehlu che. Okay? And some of the zooplankton particle. Zooplankton means amoeba, paramecium like animals they are. We can say zooplankton, right? And there will suspended developmental stage will be there. The particular term is used that is called a diapause, right? In the unfavorable conditions, there will suspended that development. That is called a what? It's a diapause phase. Okay? So that is the four kind of uh, different different um, kind of organisms. Some of them are regulators. Some of them are conformers. Some of them are migratory. Or suspended. Now adaptation. See, adaptation is your important questions of your 12th science. Okay, four marks question. Now, as far as adaptation is concerned, what is the definition of it? In first three line, the adaptation definition is given. The coping with the extremes in the environment, certain physiological and behavioral adjustment that is called what adaptation. See. Some extreme, like in temperature, like in osmoregulatory, or other aspect is concerned. In the environment, extreme limits can be crossed. In that case, whatever, certain organisms can be changed their physiological activities, or even some of them behavioral adjustment is seen in some of the organisms, and such kind of phenomenon is called what it is called adaptations. Now, adaptations may be morphological, physiological, or behavioral. 
See, morphological adaptation is what? So, you chapter 5, 11th year. Fifth chapter, you have to do it. So, you have to do it. See, adaptation is for the food storage. Adaptation is for the protection, for the vegetable, for the vegetative reproduction. These are the morphological, like uh, you know, that uh, stem tendrils and the thorns and spines. These are morphological characteristics. Is concerned. As far as physiological adaptation is concerned, like adaptation is for the photosynthesis, like in Opuntia, generally photosynthesis physiology is carried out by leaf. Instead of that, stem is carried out the photosynthesis physiology. That is physiological adaptation. Behavioral adaptations, like you see in the hibernation and restoration from it undergoes suspended phase and that is called that behavioral will be suspended okay so that is three kind of uh, main adaptation sees now one two three four five six seven that is a different different example is given okay now first example is kangaroo rat see kangaroo rat is available into the north america is little bit large size that's compared to the normal rats now it's available in the desert kangaroo rat is now what happened how they can maintain the water content into the body see through the lipid oxidation of their body okay whatever the water is synthesized during the lipid oxidation along with that they will cope up with this the, the water requirement will be depends upon the lipid oxidation okay lipid oxidation mathe je water mala je ena to potani water requirement full fill kare se second thing they will excite the concentrated urine so that is what what happened larger amount of the water cannot be accepted along with the urine so that is the another adaptation for the kangaroo rat that is number one now number two is that is many desert plants like opuntia right what happened that thick cuticle is available so that is why the maximum transpiration can be prevented second thing you can see sunken stomata like it's available in the uh, cruise and that is why the rate of transpiration can be reduced and third crassulation acid metabolism and the photosynthesis yet come crassulation acid check and the metabolism hoi so you need water to go from there no that is one of the adaptations of many desert plants as well as apuntia in the apuntia what happened they will remove the leaves so that is why maximum transpiration cannot be occur that leaf is converted into spines and thorns okay and it's stem is carried out the photosynthesis that is one of the adaptations now alien stools the next point is see alien stool is concerned generally the colder climate what happened some of the organisms their ear will be shorter as well as limb will be shorter because of through the limbs and the ears they can accept the heat from the body right and if they will accept it larger amount of heat from the body then particularly they will not survive right and in that case what happened in that case particularly the polar regions or particularly the polar climates they have shorter extremes can you remember this word about the shorter extremes that is for alien birds the another point is given that uh, in the uh, seal fish which is available in polar region the skin is having the lipid layer insulating layer we can say which uh, prevent the heat loss from it blubber is the particular term is used the lipid layer just beneath the skin is concerned okay now altitudinal sickness you can see that at the higher altitude means more than 35 meter uh, height is concerned like the kailas mansarovar and darjeeling etc we will feel some nausea miss upka ave then fatty apne thaki jaiye or even particularly high palpitation ela apna je heart beat che e e vadhi jay che e u badu thai che right vomiting so thai che but after some times when you will establish over there for a one week or more than that in that case you will adjust then there will no such kind of symptoms can be then you can acclimatize in that particular area okay but it should take time then how the particular tribes which is available over there which kind of adaptations they have see number of rbc or percentage of hemoglobin is higher in that particular area 
or even when we will acclimatize in our body, hemoglobin as well as RBC will be increased. That is why the hemoglobin efficiency will be decreased. Because hemoglobin efficiency decrease, that's why we are going to get hemoglobin. So, the oxygen is more safe. So, oxygen and hemoglobin are connected. And in our body, we are going to get more safe. And so, we are going to get more efficiency. And the number of RBC and the percentage of hemoglobin is more safe. तो सो था कि थोड़ा थोड़ा पर जेटलों पर ऑक्सीजन मिला जाए बदौर अपना बॉडी में डिजोल्व था ही अने फास्ट प्रोसेस था ही शक्के ने ब्रीथिंग मारे मार बंद हो ना बार में ब्रीथिंग था ही शक्के अदरवाइज हम ब्रीथिंग मारे मार प्रॉब्लम आउट होता बराबर सर दैट इज़ द वन डायलेक्टेशंस देन आपका जनरली but you know that archibacteria, some microbes, they can survive even more than 100 degrees Celsius temperature. Right? So in that case, they are having such kind of uh, adaptations that they can survive in that temperature. Now, even marine invertebrate is concerned. If they are living in the bottom of the sea, in that case, what happened? As compared to the normal atmospheric uh, uh, pressure is concerned, it is more than 100 times than the normal atmospheric pressure, even though they can survive. And how it is possible? It is possible because of the question is given, but I have given that uh, what is the reason? First of all, there is no air sac, no air bladder. That is why they can bear such kind of pressure. And second thing, is there any enzyme or any molecule is there? See, Paisonics kind of uh, small organic compound is there. All organic molecule is there and that is responsible that they cannot cross their body or their, their body protein because of such a pressure. That pressure can as an organic molecule survive. Okay, that is the reason they have this. It is even in some reference books. Now, as far as desert lizard is concerned, like a desert lizard is like a right? And calories. Particularly the desert lizard is concerned what happened. Generally when the temperature is so higher in the desert, in that case what happened? Particularly they will escape into the borrow and that is why or in another the plants. Another the plants. In that case what happened? It's instead of that uh, high temperature they can escape from there. And if the colder climate is concerned, how cold it will be, so correct. Okay, if you want to go to the skin, they will pass the skin, and the skin is sick, and then the temperature is increased into the atmosphere. In that case, what happens? Again, they will come back to the borough or other etc. habitat. So, that is the different kind of adaptations which is carried out by the different kind of organisms बराबर चहे तो अपने अतुल चहे ना ये अजे रखिए चाहिए बराबर एडेप्टेशन सर ना पॉइंट्स थे ये अबे पॉपुलेशन चहे ना ना अजे पॉइंट्स चहे एक दार करने पर एक साथ आया हुआ चहे इन नेक्स्ट डे वी विल गो थ्रू द डिफरेंट कॉन्सेप्ट के करीब तू पॉपुलेशन इज़ ओके हैव अ नाइस डे